Hey guys, I'm Nisha Homi. Today I'm sharing a high protein oats breakfast smoothie for weight loss and weight management. This healthy smoothie is loaded with fiber, antioxidants, protein and omega 3s. It's easy to make on those busy mornings and does not contain any added sugar or dairy milk. The high fiber helps to keep you feel fuller till lunch time and thus helps in weight loss and weight management. So let's get started with the recipe. To make high protein oat smoothie, into a bowl I am adding in 3 tablespoon old fashioned rolled oats. I prefer to use old fashioned rolled oats as they are high in fiber. Into this I am adding in some water and I am allowing the oats to soak for about 10 to 15 minutes. Now the reason why you need to soak oats is to release the phytic acid content in oats. Grains like oats contains phytates which is a nutrient inhibitor. For better assimilation of nutrients, it's always ideal to soak grains before using them. Now, for those who have noticed having digestive issues like gas, bloating, indigestion when consuming oats, it will be ideal to soak it for a longer period, like maybe one to two hours or even an overnight soak. So now I'm going to soak it for about 10 to 15 minutes. Okay, now it's about 15 minutes and the oats are nicely soaked. So I'm going to add it into a strainer and then keep it under running water so that it will get rinsed. Okay, now the oats are strained and rinsed. And now I'm going to add this into my blender jar. I'm adding in the soaked oats into my blender jar. Into this I'm adding in one glass or one cup of water. To make this high protein, I'm adding in 1 fourth cup of roasted peanuts. Peanuts not only gives protein and fiber, they are also a good source of natural healthy fats. Natural healthy fats helps in better assimilation of fat soluble vitamins. So always try to make sure there is a good source of healthy fat in your meals. For some added fiber, protein and omega 3s, I'm adding in 1 tablespoon flax seeds. Now, for those who are in doubt whether the flax seeds will get ground along with the ingredients, it will get ground along with the ingredients when it is being blended. There is no need to add in flax meal or ground flax seeds. For added protein, fiber and omega 3s, I am adding in 1 teaspoon chia seeds. You can increase chia seeds up to 1 tablespoon if you prefer. For flavor, I'm adding in a stick of cinnamon. Cinnamon not only gives an amazing flavor, but also helps to boost your metabolism. Now, if you don't have a cinnamon stick at hand, you can use half teaspoon cinnamon powder instead. So I'm just lightly breaking the cinnamon stick into smaller pieces and adding in so that it will get blended easily. For sweetness, I'm adding in one soft medjool dates. You can increase or decrease dates as per your sweetness. And lastly, I'm adding in one ripe banana. Note that the banana I'm using has black spots. The more riper and the more black spots the banana has, the more sweeter it will be. I'm roughly slicing the banana into the blender. And I'm going to blend this on high speed until everything is nicely mixed and combined. Pour the blended smoothie into a serving glass. You can see how creamy the smoothie is. I'm garnishing the smoothie with a teaspoon of roasted peanuts. This will also give an amazing crunch to the smoothie. And lastly, I'm sprinkling in just a fat pinch of cinnamon powder for an added flavor. And my super healthy fiber and protein rich oats breakfast smoothie is ready to serve so guys do try this healthy oatmeal smoothie and let me know how it turned out thank you for watching and until next time take care bye bye